Hello my soccer universe! <laughs> now we are in between the um, round of 16 and the quarterfinal as I'm shooting this video and since this video is released and you're watching it this means that the team that I've ordered in here has made it to the semifinals. Okay, let me pause the video right here. We are now the day after the quarterfinals, so ahead of the semifinals, as the background uh, says. And the team has not made it to the semifinals. However, I changed my mind and a little bit more on that after this video, where I needed to use some heavy editing to make it actually watchable for the case that this team has not qualified for the semifinal. And I have decided already before, well, just in case, I better get that jersey because I could find it at a really, really good price. And that was, uh, I think, even before the round of 16 match or, or straight thereafter. Uh, and I said, yeah, I don't really like that jersey. Let's be honest. I am not a big fan of this one. It has a few features that I don't mind having, but overall, I don't really like this jersey. Uh, however, um, Sportcheck, I found it uh, brand new with tags for around 60 and then I could, which, which was the cheapest over, over, overall, in, in, including shipping. And then I could apply a 20% coupon code and I said, okay, that's worth it. You know, it's a great, it's a great uh, memento to have of this World Cup. Well, who wants to remember? I guess if you're a fan of this uh, team, you might want to remember. Let's put it that way. Uh, <laughs> well, let me give you a little hint. It's the Netherlands jersey. And let's open it up. There's only one paper, so yes. That's fine. And the one to seemingly protect the crest. And that's uh, already one thing I didn't, don't like. So, here is the jersey. If you've seen my tour, jersey review, you already know, and uh, probably most of you know that uh, I will would agree, the color of the orange is definitely off. Definitely off. Um, I think what, I, what intrigued me is that, you know, the lion, it's kind of a black lion, a black shield with the orange lion. But that's the other thing. Um, if you were to buy this one, note that this lion here, is just very very simply put on there it has no depth whatsoever it's just basically outlines whereas if you get and let me pull the 2014 away jersey and this was up until 2020 if you look at this lion not only is it bigger but it has a whole lot more depth to it which looks absolutely awesome and amazing so uh just just by pure comparison, size-wise, there is actually no com comparison. This is when Nike actually, in my opinion, went really, really cheap uh, in a way. Uh, it doesn't look that much better in the Wave Bonnet, however, in the Wave way Bonnet, there's a lot more depth to that logo, which might make it worthwhile. I'm just telling you this. Uh, I usually am not promoting the weapon in versions. I honestly think they're overpriced uh, to, a, to a degree. Uh, but so are the, states, the, the stadium versions. But you get a little bit more. Um, I also find this boomerang shape here on the back a little bit odd. I do get that this should be a lion's mane. So that makes it kind of interesting, uh, I would think. But I have to say that the logo, while I do like the colorway, I'm not super uh, eh, not super excited about it. However, as I said, I have been a fan of the Dutch for a long time. Okay, a little bit of explanation is in order why I have changed my mind, as I said at the, uh, at the beginning. Because my full intention when I bought this jersey was, okay, let's get this. It was right before the quarterfinals. I found it for a good price. I could use the 20% uh, coupon that Sportcheck has sent to me. And I said, yeah, that uh, will work out. If they make it great, if not, I'll return it. I don't like it all that much anyway, but it, it, it was a little bit of, of a gamble. 
And even when I unpacked it, you know, I was still very, very much under, under, under pressure. It's not such a great jersey. However, my opinion changed almost the next morning when I decided, okay, if I have it now, let's at least use it to make my Instagram post on a jersey matchup that I would like to have. So I took the jersey out and you see already with the sun going, I really like this glow effect that it had suddenly on it. Um, for the first time I got it and I have to say, yeah, I actually started liking it quite some. It is something different. In addition, I remember yeah, the Dutch are hosting the Nations League final four where they will play in this shirt. And then what really sold me, and unfortunately we didn't get that matchup, when I held it next to this purple shirt. That would have been a great color matchup that I would have loved to see the Netherlands against Argentina Ar Ar to be played in. And so, yeah, uh, my wife asked me um, about it. And so what do you think about it? I mean, I asked her and she said, yeah, you, for, for, for me, it's a four out of 10. I said, yeah, for me, it was even worse. I gave it a three out of 10. But when the direct light hits on it, I absolutely love it. There is something about it. I mean, I actually want to move this up almost to five out of 10 uh, in my review because now that I have, I have seen in person, still bugs me that the crest is just a flat line and not the one that we used to have. If a France, they uh, seemingly kept it. Um, and that it's a little bit smaller. It still bugs me maybe that the orange is a little bit lighter, but you know, when I compare it to here, you know, it's a little bit of a change as well. And I know the Dutch used to have lighter orange so yeah i'm gonna keep this one uh, it's a little bit of a tough decision for me to be honest because i have spent too much money on jerseys but actually i i couldn't find myself parting with it and my wife said yeah i understood it I'll keep it if you if you like it and, and and again if just like this it's maybe not that agree but as soon as the sunlight hit i thought this is something else so yeah, I have changed my opinion on this admittedly odd jersey, but I think it is at least it is much better than I initially thought. In any case, I would like to hear your opinion on this Dutch jersey. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this, and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!